Hi guys! Hello and welcome back to Honest Media Reviews mm -hmm. and today we're going to be reviewing Disney Box! <laughs> <laughs> yep and uh, before we do we'll introduce ourselves. My name's Ben and I'm Carrie Ann and um, we will be reviewing Zavi's box? Yes, Zavi's Disney Mystery Collector's box. Um, this mm, goes that rolls off the tongue nicely, <laughs> doesn't, doesn't it? It's a mouthful, it's like Peter picked the but I'll just, dip. Yeah, I'll stop there. So it says, grab a Disney Mystery Collector's box filled to the brim with five different Disney items worth over £50. Um, one thing that is com confirmed that you get with the box, it says each box contains a Aladdin Genie Funko Pop. Movie moments, oh, such a mouthful. I love how you're reading worth it. Worth <laughs> Yeah, I have to read this because otherwise we'll say it wrong and you will get misinformed. And we don't want that. Mm -hmm. so, so, without much further ado, I'll hand it off to the Disney box. This one's more for Carrie this time, so finally, I know, oh. finally a box that she can have. <laughs> no, it's not that a box that I can have, it's just... It's just something you're interested in, isn't it, Disney and things like that. And, yes. you know, hopefully the content's in it are okay. good for you. There's something here. Okay. Okay. So we'll start off with this that I can already see, which won't be for me, but it may be. <laughs> I mean, how do you drink from that as well? That's such a weird... Do you go like that? Do you have your lunch like that? <laughs> all right, all right, guys. <laughs> yeah. um, so this will be like for our niece or something or whatever. I'd probably wash it beforehand. <laughs> yes. So that's cute. It's obviously not for me, but it's, it's cute if you've got like little nieces on, or even, or even children, yeah, or children that like Frozen, and that'd be a good Christmas present for them. Yes, that little lunchbox. Something different. And drinky mm. thingy. Okay, so we'll go for the little things. Um, so the, there's Egg. another little. Fr it's <laughs> so, right, it didn't crack. It's well, not a real so. egg. Okay, anyway. It's a little, it's a frozen egg. Cute. Should we open it? Yeah. Okay. Do you want to help me open it? Yeah, I'll try. Please. Thank you very much. Okay. Oh, they're cute. Oh, look, it's a little reindeer. Oh, you get some name is. It's a vent, I think. Is it? No, it's it's, it's the vent of a person. I can't remember, did it tell you that? It's a... cute. Yeah, it's a vent. So it seems to be. I don't know. So see. that's a cute little tiny gift. Apart from the big things that are in here. So yeah, there's quite some big things. That's cute. There. So next one. Oh, that's, that's cool. Quite heavy. I yeah. love Zootopia. Okay, yeah. so Zootopia. Also known okay. as. Final. Yes. Known as no, the Zootropolis. films. Are, yeah, Zootropolis in the US and in the UK. I think it's called Zootopia. So you've got characters all around. Cute. So let's see what we've got. Yeah, that's pretty cool. Do, do, do. Let's see what we've got. Oh my goodness! <laughs> <laughs> we'll get there eventually. It is. Oh, cool. Cool. I don't know what his name is. I say, cute. That's quite heavy, you know. I think they cut this paper with Idris Elba in the film. Idris Elba is, yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah. Okay, so that's three little things. So that's like the little gifts in the box so far, and then we get to the bigger options. So the next one is a Funko, that's pretty and cool. it looks like a Mickey Mouse. <laughs> oh, that's cute. Brave little Taylor. Mickey, the true original. Um, it's part of the 90 years celebratory Funko, I'm guessing. That's pretty cool. That one, I do like that. I'm oh, not normally yeah. a fan it's of the, it's the original. Stuff, but... It's the original um, Mickey Mouse's. Oh, I love the black and white ones. Um, and this is Don't the one the we got it, yeah. is Brave Little Taylor. Taylor. He's really sweet. Oh, he's really cute. He looks like a little Robin Hood hat. <laughs> or Peter Pan he hat and he's got little scissors and that's the one we got so oh, obviously he cute. does clothes in his meantime yeah <laughs> that's a really cute one actually oh I love the apprentice Mickey that's really cool is that wow. from Fantasia it is yeah yeah Fantasia conductor Mickey steamboat Willie that's what yeah. Mickey was originally called the black and white ones um, yeah yeah I like them yeah, really that's nice. pretty cool yeah that's, that's really actually nice. really cool it's huge! That's pretty cool. 
So this is obviously the big, the, the, the most significant. So this is the like, item they said that's twenty nine ninety nine. This big um, one is, yeah. I don't know how much this one would go well, for. Like I said, but that that's... probably ranges for what it is, around 15 to 20 pounds at a push. Yeah, so um, you've already made your money's worth out of those items that have already yeah. just opened. So this dude, oh my goodness, this is it. Ah! Okay, so this is the newer, that. No, on. it's the uh, original old Robin No Williams. way! Yeah, that's sick. That oh is pretty cool. Oh my goodness, look at that. Aladdin's first wish. Wow. That's awesome. That is, that is, I think, really cool. Alone, that would probably be worth £30. Definitely. Wow, I'm happy with that. That is amazing. Yeah. You've got um, Vanellope. And Harry Potter, basically. Yeah, and Harry Potter, yeah. And now you've got these. Well, yeah, Disney wise, I've got Vanellope, um, uh, Cogsworth. Cogsworth from Beauty and the Beast. Um, can't really think of any of us. But yeah. Well, we'll come back to those at another time. <laughs> yeah, but yeah, um, these I'll probably end up giving to other people um, as little little items that they can have. Um, but yeah, these are the two that I'll keep out of the box. Yeah. So yeah, Disney! Um, whether it's worth the full box with all the items, obviously it's worth it for just those two items. Plus, obviously you got some maybe extra ones that I'd class as freebies anyway. And it does say because they're mystery items, you're not necessarily guaranteed to get those. I imagine you'll probably get something similar. Um, mm. But you know. And you? Sorry, Abby. No, it's fine. And do you think um, everyone will get this same one? I'm not sure if you get this one. They do confirm you'll get one worth £30. I don't know how many different variations there are of the Aladdin ones, so I'd imagine it probably will be these, but that's not a bad thing if it is. Uh, no, it might not be the same one as this, it might be yeah. different. But if but anyone's that one will got. Be different, yeah. yeah, if anyone else has got this box, then let us know what you got. Yeah, um, tell us what items you got that are the same, which one, and uh, you know, as always, we'll post the link to the box on the video below. Mm. What was your favourite? Definitely this. I think this is really cool. And I'm not normally a fan of Disney. When it comes to things like Disney, I'm a Scrooge. We'll find there's some irony in that comment because I love Marvel. I love Star Wars. We're owned by Disney now. So in a way that kind of makes me like Disney. Well in a way they weren't Disney to begin with. No. So, so you know. But ultimately by default you like Disney. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> but I think these these are brilliant. Like, you know, Lennon's first wish. I think that's a brilliant fun card to get. You don't often actually see these around. You probably can get like, them online. Like the, um, the boxes of two, yeah. Yeah. Um, and normally when you do get these big boxes, they do range literally from £30 as a minimum. They can go up to 50 Uh Being Disney Aladdin, they'll probably go up in price over time. Especially these being the original Aladdin. Yeah, because they'll only have a certain amount of stock anyway, and then it will get to the point where they have quite a lot of value on later on. Nice. I do love this. No, no, it's quite cool. But if you are unsure, I'll post a link to an app as well um, where you can actually see what the price is going for Funkos. So if you are interested in seeing the price range of things, That's good. you can also add your collection and it tells you how much totals yours are worth. So, Have you done that yet? Yeah, I've done it. And uh, there's quite a lot there. I need to do an update of stuff because I've recently got more Funkos. Oh, and, um, and my new edition of the Harry Potter train. Um, mm. I've got and stuff like that. Yeah. And then, uh, like I said, the app's really good. I can't remember what the top, the top of my head it is. I think it is something to do like the Funko Pop Price app. Um, like I said, I'll post, the yeah, I'll post the link below once the video's done. And uh, Sure thing. We'll take a look. Thanks, guys. Bye for now. See you soon. Certainly will.